Hello, for uh, lecture 11, we are going to address uh, the identification of the um, architecturally significant requirements. So, uh, I want you to, to answer this question. So, what are the techniques and methods to identify architectural significant requirements? And uh, then I would like you to relate uh, what is in the book chapter with the guide to thread modeling for developers and to see what uh, if they apply uh, di similar techniques or at least if they have uh, similar or different concerns when do, do, uh, doing this. And um, actually I want you to to go through, to understand again, to, to, to read again the, this idea of going from uh, uh, business schools. We will find the concept of uh, architectural driver so to understand what is relevant uh, when you are considering uh, uh, the identification of requirements for your architecture what where should you what should you emphasize what is really relevant what uh, uh, should we discuss with the stakeholders how to prioritize uh, uh, the most relevant uh, requirements that kind of things and uh, there's an emphasis on the description of uh, business goals so Please read this table, understand this table, understand how, how can you describe a business goal. And of course then how the business goals are uh, decomposed uh, into a set of uh, architectural significant requirements which are more technical and more related to particular uh, qualities of the system. Okay, so it's this, this, this breach that I want you to, to discuss and uh, address. We'll see some uh, business goals here. For, here, for instance, uh, Westcheck actually was the business one of the business goals of Phoenix, okay, and another business goal of Phoenix, which which are described from a very high uh, point of view, from the stakeholders' point of view, probably not not pretty technical, but 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 related with the the impact the, does it uh, have to the business, which actually is the the ultimate reason why we develop a software system. Okay, so read the documentation and um, we'll, we'll discuss it during the class. Bye.